All right, one Valley vet kicks out clean shoes over Instagram. But there's more to the man behind this booming business. T12's William Pitts has a story. Squeaky. Let's give the shoe a nice wipe down. Clean. And we're good to go. And ready to hit the streets. Damn, Daniel. Scottsdale's Kai Ellenson is the shoe king. You need to ring to get the bling. A lot of recurring customers. Most people I work with, are just they just say, throw me an invoice. IVO stands for invoice only. It's kind of how IVO was born. It used to be AZ shoe clean. Four months into the shoe game, the idea behind his rapidly growing cleaning business started like a shower thought. One day I was just looking at shoes and I usually just go buy a new pair of shoes when they get dirty. I'm like, some of these shoes go for two, three hundred, and sometimes up into the thousands. I'm like, you know, so I'd pay someone, you know, like 20, 25 bucks to go and get my shoes clean. I was actually at the gym when I came up with the idea. But it's in the kitchen where you can find some of his tricks for clean kicks. I started out with, I think it was baking soda mm -hmm. and Dawn dish soap. I mean, I just kind of started testing other products. I'd make my own stuff. But his garage office has the pro secrets to pump out the polish from lows to mids and even high society. You gotta meet a lot of people. Some people that own some exotic dealerships, exotic car dealerships. You meet one person, they have immense connections. Who wear everything from Air Jordans, Louis Vuittons, Yeezys, and more. But the client still wants them to look fresh, and that's what we do here. Shoes weren't the original game plan. Yeah, I was in the uh, army. But I did rotate to Germany and get to work with German forces. I did like signal stuff, like computer stuff. I think that really developed me as a person, getting to see like a different culture and working with just different people, like the language barrier. But there's no telling how far IVO will run. Maybe take orders in from all over the world. For now, Kai's lacing one loop at a time. Well, shoe cleaning isn't really my main thing. I've done a lot of like online stuff. I mean, really my focus right now is just content. I mean, most of the shoes I choose are made for content. When I first started, I had very big dreams for it. And I still do, but I'm just taking it easy. I mean, uh, it's not necessarily going anywhere in the sense of like, it's not just gonna disappear and um, not really pushing anything. I think another part of it is just, it's nice uh, being able to just meet the community. And helping put one foot in front of the other for sneakerheads in the Valley. William Pitts, 12 News. I love it, William, thank you. A lot of people who